This is WYMT Mountain Sports, your home for the Kentucky Wildcats and local high school sports. 36-0 and still playing. Kentucky is one of the 16 teams left in the NCAA tournament, but head coach John Calipari apparently does not fit the credentials of Coach of the Year according to the U.S. Basketball Writers Association. Virginia's Tony Bennett wins the Henry IBA Award today in his sixth season as the Cavaliers head coach. He went 30-4 and and led the Cavs to a second straight ACC regular season title. His team, though, was eliminated from the NCAA tournament by Michigan State on Sunday. So Cal does not win that award, but he and his cats are after something a little bigger these days, a national championship. Calipari now takes his team into the Sweet 16 and a matchup with West Virginia Thursday night. Right now, he would certainly like to see Devin Booker shooting the rock better from three-point range. Booker is 0 for 7 from behind the arc in the NCAA tournament, and he's hit just three of his last 16 three-point shots. I'm not on fire, but, you know, like I said, you know, it's going to come along, and I know it is. And my team trusts me, and, you know, the whole coaching staff trusts me, and, you know, I've stressed it, you know, in almost every question, like, you know, I'm, that's the least of my worries right now. I'm worried about winning, and, and as long as we're winning, I'm all right. All right, so Book isn't shooting well at the moment, but perhaps the good news for Kentucky is that the entire West Virginia team hasn't shot well all season long. The Mountaineers rank 282nd in the nation in field goal percentage, but they have forced a whole lot of turnovers, like 468 of them. And those points, or those turnovers, turn into points, and that's good enough for old Huggy Bear. You know, that's what we are. We're not, it's, it's you know, I, for, it seemed like everywhere we go, people say, well, it's not pretty. Well, I think it's beautiful. I mean, I, I, I love it. I love the fact that we can not make shots and, and, and still win, still find ways to score. Kentucky, West Virginia, the Bluegrass State versus the Mountain State in the Sweet 16 location. Cleveland, Ohio at the Q. UK and Dub V will tip off at approximately 9.45 p.m. Eastern inside Quicken Loans Arena. You can watch the game right here on WYMT. This is the last week of U Pike Top Play contenders. Here are the best plays from the boys' Sweet 16. First contender, Williamsburg, Corey Shelton. Corey Shelton, part of a 13-0 run to start the first round game against Doss, second nominee, Skyler Griffith. He's in trouble against Doss. It finds uh, Corey Shelton eventually, the pump fake, and the bucket. He finished with 19, but the Yellow Jackets would lose. Third nominee we go, Johnson Central taking on Ballard in round one. Kyle Gullett and the goggles. That's good stuff there. Next contender, same game. Heads up play here by Gullett. Off the air ball miss from Braxton Blair. He tips it over to Patrick Rice. J.C. falls to the Bruins, though. Fifth contender, not central playing Callaway County. And on its first possession of the game, Evan Hall be like, get that out of my house. Nah, seriously, man, I've been here for like four years. Six nominee, cue up the camera justice montage. Mr. Basketball himself went out with a bang at the state tourney, including so many clutch shots against Callaway County. He went on an 8-0 run all by himself at one point in this game. 39 points in his final game rock in the not central jersey. He's headed to Vanderbilt. Kevin Stallings has himself a kid who can get himself buckets. To vote on the UPike top plate contenders, go to the sports tab on WYMT.com. Click top five plays. Of course, we'll count them down at six, as always, on Thursday, guys. All right. Thanks, Jamie. We'll be right back.